Ever felt like your brain is a million tabs open at once? To-do lists overflowing, notes scattered like digital confetti, and project deadlines looming like storm clouds? Yeah, us too. That's why productivity apps have become a modern-day lifeline. But with so many options out there, choosing the right one can feel like navigating a software jungle. Today, we're focusing on a popular contender, Notion. This all-in-one workspace promises to tame your digital chaos. But a question lingers, is Notion a Chinese app? This seemingly simple question can spark some confusion. The answer, however, reveals a deeper story about the ever-evolving landscape of tech giants and global accessibility. So, buckle up, knowledge seekers, because we're diving down the rabbit hole of Notion's origins and its journey in the world's most populous country. First things first, let's clear the air. Notion was actually born in the heart of Silicon Valley, developed by a U.S.-based company called Notion Labs. Founded in 2013, their mission? To create a workspace that transcends the limitations of traditional note-taking apps and project management tools. Think of it as a digital Switzerland, offering a neutral ground for all your organizational needs. Now, here's where things get interesting. Notion's global appeal is undeniable. Students use it to streamline their studies, entrepreneurs to manage their businesses, and writers to craft captivating content. But in 2020, Notion mysteriously vanished from the screens of Chinese users. The app, once readily accessible, became shrouded in a digital fog. So what happened? Here's where theories start to swirl. Some speculate it was a political move. Others point to a potential conflict with a similar Chinese app. The official reason from Notion, however, remains shrouded in secrecy. This lack of transparency fueled speculation. Some users resorted to VPNs, those virtual private networks, to access the blocked app. But this workaround isn't ideal for everyone. It raises security concerns and adds an extra layer of complexity for casual users. The story of Notion in China highlights a broader trend, the ever-changing relationship between global tech companies and the Chinese market. The Great Firewall, China's internet censorship system, can create hurdles for foreign apps. Now, this doesn't mean there aren't alternatives for Chinese users. Domestic developers have created apps that mirror Notion's functionality. Whether these measure up in terms of features and user experience is a whole other debate. So, to answer our original question, no, Notion is not a Chinese app. But its experience in China showcases the complexities of navigating a globalized tech world. With that said, thanks for watching and until next time. Keep on exploring the fascinating world of productivity tools.